A nice patio area next to your house can be a great place to enjoy a cup of coffee in the middle of the day or in the morning. And you'll think, maybe I need a nice shade tree that has good fall color with brilliant green foliage that'll give protection from the hot rays of the sun and make the place a little cooler and more comfortable. You better think about what a maple tree can do, especially a Norway maple. This one's a 75 year old tree and look what the roots can do. It can really tear up the joint. You don't need this next to a house, a walkway, or a patio. It'll lift it up and move it for you. So don't plant this tree. It's really tough with the roots. Even in a flat area, the roots poke up out of the ground, making it almost impossible to mow with a lawnmower. You practically need a weed whacker to trim around this tree. What you can plant, however, are all kinds of small shrubs and small trees that don't have invasive roots. And some of the trees and shrubs that you might want to consider would be something like a ginkgo. A ginkgo is very good at, at creating a deeper root system than a maple tree, so it doesn't push up on the patios and decks and walkways that you have. Ginkgos are also very tolerant of all kinds of environmental problems. A ginkgo is so strong of a tree that it even survived the dinosaur extinction and a Hiroshima bomb. So you can plant a ginkgo tree. It's a tough tree and it'll provide nice protection and shade for your patio or walkway. This is Bill at Highland Hill Farm. If you want more tree suggestions, you can call us at 215-651-8329. We sell many different kinds of trees and shrubs and we're located in Fountainville, PA near Doylestown in Bucks County. Here are some other examples of trees we recommend with non-invasive roots. This is Cornus moss. And these trees are Japanese red maples. And we grow a lot of another tree called the redbud. This is the forest pansy redbud. You can call us for more information on our trees at 215-651-8329. If you do decide to plant a maple tree, make sure you plant it at least 25 to 30 feet away from a building, a walkway, or a patio. That way it won't be so invasive for your property. And also keep it away from a septic system if you have a private septic system.